Okay, in this video, I want to show you how to set up three wire control for the PowerFlex 525 using the TII Education Systems model ACD 525. So this is what, there are a number of steps that have to happen in CCW to make this happen. The first parameter we want to go to is in the basic programs. That's going to be 46. And right now, at the start source is set to the keypad. So I'm going to come here and select Digital Terminal Block and hit Enter. This should change the internal value to 2. Now, the next step we have to take is we need to go to the terminal blocks now that we've activated them. So the first one we want to change is 62, and this is going to be for 3 wire. And hit Enter, this will change this to 49. Let's go ahead and download it and see how this works. So I hit the start button here, stop button here, nothing's happening. Okay, nothing's happening here, all right? All of my start sources and everything, nothing's activated. So what I want to do now is I want to go um, back to the terminal block parameters and I want to change this to three wire as well. And this should change this to 51. So I'll come here, I'm going to download this, activate my start button. This will run to whatever frequency my keypad potentiometer is set to. And I can adjust this here. So I'll let this set a limit around 31 uh, hertz. And if I activate the stop button, this shuts down the VFD. Three wire control, meaning I can push it step away, let it run up, and then whenever I'm done, I can come here and hit the start button. Really pretty simple. And these are the steps that it takes to set up a three-wire control using CCW for the PowerFlex 525. This was just a quick video on how to set up three-wire uh, control. And if you enjoyed the video, please hit the like and subscribe button. Thank you.